You can find anything on Google. You can go find a website for anything. But how do you know if you can trust a website? It can be very difficult. So read reviews, um, do research to know what the official website is of an organization. When you go to the website, make sure that when you look at the URL that it says HTTPS on any page where they're asking you to actually enter data or provide information because the S indicates that it's secure. Oftentimes there'll also be a little lock on, the, on that page as well. So it doesn't have to be on every page, just on the order pages where I'm entering my personal information up top in the, in the URL string. Any page where you are providing any sensitive information, frankly, any information, you should always make sure that it says HTTPS, because if it doesn't, you run the risk that the information you provide could be in clear text, it may not be encrypted, it may not be secure, and you're exposing yourself. Is it easier for, is it an a endorsement for a site? I, went, I ordered something recently from a smallish site, wouldn't normally have trusted it, but I was able to use Amazon Pay, which somehow made me more comfortable. Well, again, you know, use anything that makes you feel more comfortable, mm -hmm. and obviously the, the more secure a payment system is, the more comfortable you can, you can feel. But again, the danger is that when you provide your data to any website, and the biggest websites in the world have experienced issues at one point or another, Amazon less than most, um, the truth of the matter is that, that you could be exposed if that organization suffers a hack. All right, but what we can do, at least at a minimum, look for HTTPS. Look for HTTPS, yeah. All right, thanks, Adam. Thanks.